he ended up on the inside of the leg, which is fine. There's lots you can do from this area as well. Oh, oh, yeah. So when I step, when I come here and I push, when I come here, I want to try to guys, if you guys have been on the inside, try to get to the outside. And that depends on where my footwork is, right? When he comes here and I come across, I'm going to step here. So my foot is close my center to his foot, right? So bring that around, here, up. And one other thing that I want you guys to do, just a real nice simple one, is I have his ankle here. Trap, why not like this? He's gonna try this, but yeah, he's gonna try right down. I'm not gonna be able to hold his leg up. So I wanna attack the ankle, which is a nice area to have. I got that nice and tight. And see what, see what Tony, he's in a good position. He's not, he's not forcing anything, he's loose, he's in a good position, like he knows he has my leg, right? If he wants to just walk me out of bounds, he can. If I turn, he's in a good position, I can't kick away, right? When you're here, you don't have to be tense. Like, you have the leg, you're in a good position. Don't waste your energy. Let this guy fight. Yeah. All right? So this hand, the one that he punched under, all I'm going to do is reach across, and with my feet, I'm going to step, and I'm going to walk behind him. So here, I reach at the post, and I'm going to walk behind him, just to take him down. So it's a real... It's not a forceful thing, it's just a tap. And how I use that is when I come in and have this, I walk behind him. So I'm not gonna run at him or try to take him that way. I'm gonna here and I'm gonna go pressure here with my shoulder and walk behind him. And that's just a real nice quick tap to follow up or whatever it is you wanna do to that person. So nothing's changed with the arm drag. That's right. Yeah? Good. Go. Cool.